Hey Capricorn, welcome to the channel. Welcome back. If you've been here before, let's jump right in. If you have Capricorn placements, this could resonate. Only take what resonates. Leave the rest for someone else, y'all. How are y'all feeling? I hope you're amazing. All right, y'all. So this could be past, present, or future energy. Could also be someone else's energy in your energy field. So please only take what's yours. Leave the rest for someone else. Don't try to force it if it's not your story. Let's get one card to start your reading. A fortune cookie prediction for my Capricorn. Commitment. Thank you to third group today to get that. It says a commitment is indicated around love or business. It will make you feel better. I think Leo got, no, not Leo. I can't remember who got this. I don't remember. Was it Gemini? I don't know. Let's get into it. Might have been Scorpio. We have sweet dream. This person is going to be your dream come true. It says satisfaction, comfortable, and lazy day. I feel like this is somebody who's going to make your life completely um, calm, peaceful, and much easier. Somebody's coming in to help you carry the load. Like if you've been stressing and been single and or maybe in a... Look at this. It's an eternal love. I feel someone very positive coming. They could be 39 or 50 years old. Or those numbers could be relevant. 39 or 50. Maybe your age. And then we have the number 41 here with idea. Hmm. Could be a Libra, Aquarius, a Gemini. Could be a Cancer. Could be a Scorpio. Okay, I can't see this card. It says, oh, what does that say? Y'all, I can't see. It says vision. I do see vis oh, suggestion, vision, and inspiration, I think it says. Imagination. Some of y'all are tracking an air sign. Variety, fantasy, and mind, number 63. Could have been born in 1963, could be 63. There's a commitment coming in here. I feel like somebody, you could be somebody you work with. They could be thinking about you at work if you don't work with them. They could be dreaming about you at night. I do feel them daydreaming about you. They see you growing old with them. I love it. Okay, let's see Capricorn. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, we. This is going to shock you. Some of y'all definitely work with this person. Three of Pentacles could be a Capricorn, another Capricorn. This person wants commitment, whoever they are. They're not playing around. They want to collaborate with you. Some of you is going to shock you. Scorpio, Aries energy, Cancer energy, because it's coming in very quick. Two major arcana. They want to build generational wealth with you. A lot of them, they think you're very smart. That's why you got this thing about the mind, bright idea. Like this person thinks you're very imaginative and smart. They're drawn. This is why I say it's an air sign. They're drawn to your mind. Whoever this person is, they see you either running a business or they work with you. Something about your business acumen. You're like business savvy. They feel like they can actually build something with you. Like y'all could work together or um, start a business together. Ooh, wait. Virgo energy. Anything else they want to say? No, you got it again. They want the, to build a family legacy, family dynasty, uh, generational wealth with you. Virgo energy. They see you as their ideal person. Pisces energy. One more card. Oh, this is so beautiful. This person has air and water placements in their chart. That is what I will tell you. Money is going to be good with them too, but I feel like you probably are more of a boss than them. That's not to suggest they're going to be you know, a bum. A lot of chemistry and attraction between the two of you and very good sex life. This person's going to check all your boxes. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, it's manifesting. This commitment is manifesting sooner than later. It says it's going to make you feel better. This person is going to fulfill all of your needs here. It could be in the spotlight. It could be a person who has a lot of options. A lot of people like them or are attracted to them or they could be seeing you this way. This person is going to fill your needs financially, emotionally, um, physically, and mentally. A lot of mental stimulation between the two of you. Okay, let's um, get these cards out of here. And let's get some love messages for you. 
even though that's what you're reading it looks like it's about i do see good money for sure i do see you and this person having like a really big home nice cars living in a lap of luxury but but still grounded though i don't feel you e either of you being like very superficial i mean you can be a little bit superficial because you are a capricorn right and you are my fellow earth sign and we do like money <laughs> But the money going to be there. It's not going to be like the thing that you fixate on because you're not going to have to. Okay, y'all. Let's get some love messages and see what Spirit has to say about this person. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. I'm telling you, I feel like somebody is watching you and you are completely unaware. It's, it's an Aquarius for some of you or a Cancer. I feel like this person has very strong feelings for you. It says someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship, right? I feel like this person doesn't have the confidence maybe to come towards you just yet, but that's going to uh, turn around because you had the magician. So this is manifesting. Major Arcana. That means it's manifesting. It's significant in your reading. So this person, like I said, could be an Aquarius. Could be somebody on the um, Capricorn Aquarius cusp. Or that, that, that could be your energy. Maybe you're hiding how you feel about someone. Let's get one more card waiting capricorn this is your energy capricorn moon some of you can have a capricorn moon it says anticipation from waiting but worth the wait yeah this person i do feel like this commitment is right there you already know the person but they're just maybe not speaking up or you're not expressing yet it says passion lived fully but without frenzy not overwhelmed savoring the moment this person just watching and taking their time and waiting it says waiting has two sides the side the sad side that experiences a sense of separation or emptiness and the serene confident side of those who await a change the faithful encounter waiting becomes anticipation which makes everything taste better mm. this person will treat you to, to the finer things in life i hear I feel like this person already has like a nice home. I'm seeing like a pool. I'm seeing like a lot of amenities in their community that they live in, like maybe even a gated community. I'm seeing something really nice for you. Anyway, it says to wait serenely for someone, write on a paper all you wish from them with a red pen. And I told the other group that got this card, look what I'm writing with a red pen. <laughs> but I'm just writing down the titles of the readings. Um, It says tie that around a bottle of red wine with a ribbon of the same color leave it to rest in the dark until the next new moon and then toast to love some of you may be meeting this person by the next new moon some of you um this is how you're going to manifest them this commitment if you're into that type of thing go for it you're manifesting a commitment here and um it's worth the wait all right y'all those are your messages. Like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and leave me a comment if you claimed this or resonated. And I will see you all tomorrow. Peace.